Welcome to the Heart Revolution Meditation on Oneness and Hope. And as we sit here and relax into our beings, we can recognize that at the moment when we have literally no choice but to slow down and to get rid of the noise, that going within is the only way to step forward. It's the best way and the only way to reach our highest potential. The universe is literally handing us this gift on a platter. And it's up to us what we do with that gift. So join me and let's change the world one meditation at a time, one day at a time, one person at a time. The more you step up into your higher self, the more you will influence the people around you and so the world will change. Just allow yourself to be really comfortable. Close your eyes if they are not already. And we'll take three five second breaths in. Place your hands on your heart and breathe in. Two, three, four, five, and out. Two, three, four, five. We'll do that two more times. And out. One more. And out. And as you sit there and you start to slowly enter your body, if you've been stressed, if you've been frantic, you'll find that that simple breathing is just bringing you back in. And in your mind's eye, I want you to see yourself anywhere on the planet you please. One of your most favorite parts, whether you've been there or not, just see it in your mind. Whether you're on a mountain, whether you're at the beach, whether you're in a room somewhere, Allow yourself to just relax and take in the scenery, the view, and whatever's around you. And I want you to start to become aware of your energy field. Your energy field is your auric field. It's the concentric rings of energy around your body. We are not ending at our skin. We continue, our energies continue outside of our bodies. Just pay attention, be aware of what that looks like for you. It might finish half a meter away from your body or it could extend as far as four, five, six meters away from your body. And as you become aware of this energy field, of your auric field, just feel into it and see what it feels like to you. Does it feel heavy? Does it feel fearful? Does it feel light? Does it feel empty? Pay attention and just observe. For those of you who appreciate and like the Archangelics, I'm going to call them in for you and those who don't, you may proceed without. And for now I'm going to call in Michael and Gabrielle, Raphael, Uriel, Santafon and Metatron to hold six directions for us, to hold that space. And we're going to ask for our auric fields to be cleansed and cleared of all the lower grade energies. Anything that is not serving us. The fear, the frustration, the angst, the worry. We're going to ask for that all to be cleansed and cleared now. Just 
pay attention and watch and see and ensure your auric field starting to clear. Allow them to raise in light levels higher and higher, higher and higher. Your field goes all the way around you, your back underneath above. Make sure all of that is cleaning out. Make sure it's all cleansed. You feel how that feels to you now. Feel the difference. And once that's done, ask for your body to be cleared as well. Every cell tissue and organ of your body to be cleared of any fear, frustration, angst, worry, concern that might be impacting you at the moment. Let every cell tissue and organ be cleansed of any lower grade energies that's creating this sense of fear. Anything that's causing a sense of worry or frustration or concern, let it be cleansed now. And as that is clearing from your body, I want to invite you to call in the universal law of oneness and the energy and emotion of hope. We're going to ask for hope to be brought in on this beautiful wave, this universal law of oneness. We're going to bring it in through our crowns, through every cell, tissue and organ of our bodies, all the way down to our feet. We're going to create a flow of this beautiful energy of oneness and hope in our crowns and out our feet. We're just going to bathe from our head, our neck, our shoulders, all the way down our arms to the tips of our fingers, through our torso, our pelvises, down your legs, down to your feet and out your feet. And as you're creating this beautiful flow, every cell, tissue and organ of your body is upgrading to this beautiful energy of hope. We're going to expand this once it reaches every part of our body. And we're going to expand it into our field so that every tiny energetic particle in our auric field is vibrating at the vibration of hope, oneness. And as we do this, we allow our hearts to open, our heart chakras to open with the knowledge that we are all one, we are all connected, we are all part of the same matrix, we are all part of the same universe, we are all one. As more and more of us sit in this energy of hope, as more and more of us open our hearts, as more and more of us have this vibration, we will inspire others to do the same. We will bring our hope and our oneness to our communities. It will spread and the world will feel the difference. If everybody in the world could hold this vibration, what a different place it would be right now. Allow it to stay in your field. Don't let it drop. As the awareness of our oneness comes in, Maintain this energy of oneness and hope. Keep it vibing through your cells, through every single particle of your body, every single energetic doorway. Allow it to vibrate with hope and oneness. Every single part of your energetic field. And now you've got this beautiful energy, I want you to in your mind's eye, take a look around where you are, whether you've chosen a mountain or a beach or a room, 
wherever you might be, you'll start to see the fabric of your surroundings disappear around you like tiles, like on a mosaic. They just start to unfold, disappear, and everything around you turns into darkness. You still feel solid. You are still sitting or lying on something solid. You just can't see what it is yet. You are safe. You are calm. And you are still vibing with oneness and hope. This darkness, this blackness, this is a blank slate. This is a new canvas that you can paint anything you want on. I'd invite you to use your heart space and open up with hope and oneness where you would like to be, what you want your life to look like, what you want you to look like and open up into it. Allow your heart to start painting a picture of what that looks like for you. With an open wide heart chakra, with complete connection to oneness, to creation, to every human being on the planet. What does your world look like? Who is there? Where are you? Create this from your intuitive voice, from your heart space that is now open and receptive. Allow it to download into your heart space from source. Allow it to come out of your heart space and into your reality. You don't need to know how to do this. Just place your intention. We are now living in a much more high vibrational world. Our intentions become reality. We think and it comes. Allow it to come. Allow it to come through you and into your reality now. When you've created this beautiful world, whatever it looks like for you, you might have created your dream home, a holiday, a relationship. You might have created a beautiful career shift. Whatever it is for you, stand up in your mind's eye. Stand up and walk around your new world and see what it looks like and feel what it looks like. Any fear that you may have, any worry, angst, frustration, see if it's there. And if it is, just bring in complete awareness, acknowledgement and acceptance of that feeling. Let it be. And let the feeling of oneness and hope help integrate it into the whole. We are all shadow and we are all light. We must acknowledge and embrace all of it in order to choose where we want to be and who we want to be. There is no right or wrong emotions. Just allow them. And once you've allowed whatever those emotions are, Infuse them with oneness and hope so that this becomes your dominant vibration. It becomes your dominant attractive field. It becomes how you see yourself in the world and how others see you. Walk around, take a look, soak it in. Feel what it feels like. The most important thing here is the feeling, the vibration. Soak it up, allow yourself to feel it. Oneness and hope. Good.
And whenever you're ready, go back to the original position you were in, whether you were sitting or standing in your new beautiful world. Know that you can come back here anytime. This is yours. Take note of who's there. Invite them along with you. And know that if your heart has created it, then these people are likely to join you on your journey. Accept everything for what it is, without judgment. Allow yourself to be this new vibration and allow yourself to be it as often as you can. Listen to this as often as you can and create this as your reality. And whenever you're ready, Wiggle your fingers and toes. Slowly open your eyes. And thank you for joining me in Heart Revolution.